months of rumour and speculation all comes to an end today as we return to racing for the opening event of what promises to be an enthralling season. Welcome along then to round one of this year's Formula One World Championship. Formula One returns to the desert today and this exceptional 3.36 mile circuit. 15 corners provide plenty of overtaking opportunities and it could be a strategic race this one with Sakir notorious for eating up the rear tires. Watch out for drivers managing their rubber at some point during the Grand Prix. It's time to see how our drivers are stacking up after yesterday's exciting qualifying session. An immense lap from Carlos Sainz yesterday puts him in pole position. With Charles Leclerc alongside. Considering the rest of the grid we have, Ricardo, Fernando Alonso, Sergio Perez, Lee, Gasly, Albon, Magnussen and Mick Schumacher, Hamilton, Russell, Max Verstappen and Stroll, Vettel, Sonoda, Lando Norris and Esteban Ocon, Joe, Liam Lawson. They'll be starting further back after an earlier grid penalty. Latifi and David Coulthard. Now, it's almost time for lights out, so let's go down to the track. A new season then, a clear slate where anything... Another spectacular Grand Prix here in Bahrain and a real champion's drive to take the win. Anthony, tell me, what was it that helped them achieve this success? Well, I honestly feel it was down to the driver and car today. I mean, we can talk driver skill all day, but if you don't have a solid team to back that, you're never going to get anywhere. When you hit that sweet spot of having both an excellent driver and an incredible car, that's when you see results like those we witnessed today.
Ferrari are at it again. An excellent performance at today's Grand Prix. And they're certainly a team that know what they're doing out there. So let's review the driver's standings. Carlos Sainz now leads the driver's championship as a result of his great performance today. So let's discuss, Ant. Who would you say is a contender for your driver of the day? There's a few contenders, but George Russell definitely stood out, I think. A really solid drive from him today and one I'm sure the fans enjoyed. Let's move on to the constructors. Ferrari take the lead at the top of the table. Been an absolutely wild weekend of Formula One action. I can't wait to see what's next.